Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some more popper slivers. We want to die roll. We're up against any Karina. I don't know. Uh, we got a one lander that unfortunately I'm just not feeling here. Can't do it. I can't do it, guys. No. Oh, these one landers are rough. Okay. What else we got? What else we got? Give me something else here. I want a mulligan. Did they keep? They kept. Keep. Uh, dump. Dump. Done. It's what we can do, but we've got to get the lands. This is a thriving grove. We're going to call... We're going to call white. I feel like we're going to need it more than the red right now. Come on, just pass the turn now. I already played my land. I'm done. I'm done. Uh-oh. We're waiting on her. There we go. Ooh, their own thriving grove. Uh-oh. <laughs> ah, are we playing a mirror? That'll be interesting. She's got stops on like all my crap. All right. Well, I'm gonna, I regretted playing that on white now. Uh, shoot. I regret everything. I had a feeling as soon as I called that, I'm like, I'm going to get a red card I'm going to need. That was my mistake. I think there's instances where you do need to call just your main colors, uh, your green or white. Uh, I don't, and I think this just wasn't one of those instances, obviously. Yep, it's the mirror. All right, cool. Mirror. Well, we've got two predatory, so we should be in a very good position for this game. A very good position. Two predatories are going to pump our team and not their team, so I am just going to put those down. Get in for some damage. They do have setup. They've got better mana than us, which is a little bit problematic with the gem hide. As they should be able to dump some, some creatures. But, 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 but. Man, if this was red, though, next turn we could have gone Heart Sliver into, like, a Sidewinder or something. We could have dumped our hand. Mm-mm-mm. Mistakes were made. We're definitely bringing in Swift Response in this match. Well, they got their own Predatory. That's good. We're still outpacing them, though. Oh, we'll take it. And now we're just going to drop... Double Sidewinder. Um, they can double block. I'm fine if they double block, because we can get rid of one of their Predatories. But they're just going to take. I'm fine with that, too. Do not lose your predatories. It's key to the mirror. We are so Arshal. Also are going to bring in blade back for the, the board stalls that we could potentially get into. We'll bring in a few of those as we learned from our last mirror match. Lead the stampede. Sure. I need a way to play this heart sliver. I can get it for a lot of damage. Four cards. What do you got? Oh, they're playing with their own heart. Uh oh. Oh, they can go heart. They can go heart into muscle, into virulent. Oh, that's nasty, dude. Oh, no. Okay. Play your heart. No, they messed up. Should play your heart. You could you could be getting all this extra mana. You can go heart into all of these and then have all these up and dump your whole hand. Hmm. Well, we get our own lord. Oh, 
Oh, am I an idiot? I'm an idiot. I'm an absolute idiot. They have gem hide. We have gem hide. How was I not playing for that? <laughs> How was I not doing that? Gosh dang it, dude. <laughs> oh, no. That's bad. That's really bad. I could have had my hand out already. I completely forgot that we had the add one mana because of their gem hide. Oh, boy. Well, they still misplayed. So now they have to chump block. They're going to lose all these guys. You know what I'm going to do, though? I am going to... Play it like this and swing with these. Do I swing with all though? Block, block. All right, they don't want to see it anymore. That's fine. They still could have survived another turn. It actually would have been a really interesting turn for them. Because let's say they, they, they have to chump block with these three. Okay, they lose some Sidewinders. Big deal, right? They lose a Viverlint. They lose Sidewinders. They still got two Lords out, and they had two Lords in hand. I had one creature, and all their guys would have gotten haste as well. They could have swung back. They could have swung back for lethal, I think. I block one. It would have been really close. I think they could have had lethal, honestly. I think they could have had lethal. They block, who cares? You lose your non-lord creatures. They drop their lords. Drop a lord. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe the, maybe the mana wasn't quite right for them. Definitely bring in Swift Response. Uh, we will bring in Bladeback. Uh, we'll, we'll keep in Striking. That's a good card. I'm going to take out Heart. I'm going to take out Hunter. Uh, do we want Hunter? Take out our winding way. Is Hunter good in this? I mean, it's... No, it can't be good. It can't be great. It's so difficult in the mirror. Take out one gem hide. Switch response, lead the stampede. Plated, plated, plated. We have our blade backs. Is prismatic strand necessary? I think I'm just going to run it like this. Let's see how it goes. They say anything to me? Yep. Alright. Said yep in the GG's. Um, okay. Sure, but we're gonna have to get a planes with our Ash Barons, unfortunately. It's not really where you want to be with the Ash Barons, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I mean, we've got a double predatory again, which is just amazing, so we've got the same lineup as last game. Double predatory, Sidewinder, so good. Well, actually, Sidewinder doesn't really do much. They play a Viverlint, turn one. Yeah, we definitely need to get our planes with this Ash Barons. Their own Predatory has entered the battlefield. We'll get hit for two. They have a good start. Yep. 
yeah, I think we just have to put down Predatory Pass for now. We just gotta outdo their Predatories. Winding Way. <clears throat> if they attack with their Predatory, I will trade because we have another one on the way. Let's see what they get with the Winding Way here. Prismatic Strands, they lose. They have a gem hide and a plated. Okay. So let's remember to use the gem hide to our, our advantage when they do drop it. Because, in fact, I maybe will even play for that. I'll just try to put out small creatures if I can. Or just fill up the board so I can just really go off in one turn. Swift response is huge. Huge right now. That is fantastic. All right. Let's just go predatory. Let's be mana efficient. Let's pass the turn. We got swift response ready to go for the predatory when it's necessary. It's going to be great. That's a good one for them. That's good. We're still out playing them, though, given the situation. So they should go gem hide here. Gem hide into whatever else they want. Empty their hand. See, don't know. You have gem hide, then you can tap out for a winding way if you really want. They're they're playing inefficiently. What did they get with this though? They got They got another predatory. Good to know. They have no good attacks. Pass into me. Oh my gosh. Oh, they mad. They mad now. I mean, what do you do with that, you know? We can't really attack in yet because of the striking. Because uh, they can just double block all of us and uh, then just kill them. But... We'll just play our patient. We'll just play our patient game. We've got three predatories compared to their two. So this is pretty big. Gem hide. All right. And now we can play swift response on anything they play. So end of turn, we can swift response their predatory. May just want to kill their striking though too, honestly. It is a bit annoying that we can't attack in. Muscle helps us. Okay. Decisions, right? We've got a stronger board. I'm tempted to kill their predatory. But I think their striking is the key thing here that's really killing us. Take out their predatory. They're left with... Oh, man. What do I... I could take out their striking right now. I feel like taking out the striking is the right call. Because we still are outpacing their power and toughness with our predatories versus theirs but we can't outpace their first strike right now. So let's go ahead and take them out. Goodbye. Give me a land. Give me another planes. So I can go lord into a plated. Uh, that's not quite what I wanted here. But I'll take a refill, I guess. Oh no, we can do a lot now. We can do a lot. Let's refill and see what we can find. Wow. Wow, that was a great hit, huh? Okay. Oh, we oh we did get another sinew. Okay, I didn't, I didn't see that. All right, so how do we want to play this? We go Lord, Lord. Cancel. We actually need to be careful. Oh. 
I'm not gonna drop the Viverlint yet. Yeah, I'm not gonna drop the Viverlint yet. Double Poisonous is... is a little scary. Let's see. Or should I? Hold up. Because I could drop the other Viverlin. Still have plenty of blockers in case they want to attack in. And then I'm starting to beat them here. They got rid of that. They played this. They played this. They have another predatory and a sinew. Wait, they have nothing in hand? How did these get into the graveyard? What? Did they have to discard down to hand size for that? Because they have nothing in hand right now. Oh, what am I worried about? Did I miss something where they had to discard to hand size? And they discarded a predatory? Hold up. Why did they discard a predatory? I'm really confused. I'm going to have to go back and watch what happened there. Because those were revealed from their winding way. And now they've got the sinew and the predatory in the graveyard. Why are they in the graveyard? Why would you choose to put a predatory in the graveyard unless they misclicked? That's interesting. But now I'm in a position where I can swing out, be presenting lethal and poisonous. They have to just make a bunch of chumps. All right. I'm really confused why they let go of a predatory. It's, it's kind of confusing. You are not the land we're looking for. Let's take a look here. Or should I just wait? I think I'm just going to try to outpace them. Wait a turn. I want to make sure I, I have full lethal presented. Right now we don't really have full lethal presented. I mean they can make blocks and they're not great blocks, but... Okay, that's interesting. So we have triple poisonous out right now. Triple poisonous, huh? Okay. Triple poisonous. Man, I'm, I'm wishing I'd brought in Prismatic now, because I could just call green and swing in. Block, 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 block. You know what? I'm just going to start swinging in carefully. Like this. I'll leave back my predatories. And maybe we start clearing some of their board. 
or at least making trades. Is this not a good attack? And it gets so tough in this mirror match. I get hit for eight this turn. Three poisonous. If they block everything. I'm just worried about the swing back. That's all I'm worried about. Fudge, dude. Alright, we'll wait one more turn. We'll wait one more turn. Gosh dang, I shouldn't have waited one more turn. That sucks. That sucks. Alright, we need our other swift response. Or something. And then they need to make a mistake. We're just board stalling. We're going to be here a minute. I need to get wide. I need to get really wide. I'm saying, ugh, these games. They got to land. Give me a refill. I just need to get wider. Come on. Triple poisonous. This is rough. Quad poisonous. Here we go. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. I need my blade back, man. Where's my blade back? Sentinel? Okay. I just really need my blade back. Alright, we're going to play this out just to set up for that too, actually. Muscle, sure. Well, we all... This is insane. Gem eyed, sure. We're just playing our creatures at this point. Insanity. He got a land. He got red. Just let me dig here, man. Blade back. Come on. All right, all right. Well, no matter what now, <laughs> we are going to have more power than them. So we have all four, right? Got all four out. Yeah, we've got all four of our Predatories, and they lost one somehow. What did they get? Oh, no. Did they get a Prismatic? Ooh. We're racing for these. These Prismatics and Bladebacks, basically. That is scary, actually. Winding Way. Creature. Ah, uh, not what I want. Alright, can I see my board a little bit, please?
This is insane. All right, let's say we swing here. Block, 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 block. Oh, let me just double check this. I think we've got it. Block, 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 block. Frick it. I'm hoping they don't have prismatic. Let's see if we got it. I mean, we got vigilance now, so let's see what happens. Oh, these games are insane. I'm wondering if he has something here. If he's got that prismatic, he might be able to save himself a little bit here, obviously. But we have the vigilance, so we're safe from a swing back now. Okay. Okay. He's saying no more poisonous, please. I think we got him just on, on lethal damage, though. He can only block so much here. And that's what I was kind of waiting for, too. I was like, we just need to get clear on lethal damage. Or, or the poisonous. We just need to make sure we could one-shot him, basically. But let's see what happens. Choosing to not block my big boy here. But it doesn't really matter. Look at this game. <laughs> uh, GG's. Love it. That was fun. Oh, man. That's insane. Oh, I finally won a mirror match. Finally. It's been so long. It's been too long since I won a mirror match, but we, we played that one good. That was funny. Maybe I could have swung in a little bit sooner, uh, but I was just playing cautiously. Um that fourth predatory kind of sealed the deal too where we're always just going to outpace them now uh but yeah whew, leave a like if you enjoyed that one make sure to subscribe if you're enjoying the nice slivers matchups and yeah stay tuned for more next week and uh more booster crackings on sunday stuff like that subscribe and we will see you guys in the next video